Roman, it's Nico. I need the cab. You need walk? No longer. There's a cab coming to you. Tell me I have to pick you up because you is cousin or something. I want to go to Juliet Street. Hey man, it'd be cool if we could listen to a different station. Asshole! So, you, uh... You've been working for Roman long? Ever since I got to this city, my friend. Roman's been screwing me ever since I got here. <laughs> yes. Hey man, don't talk shit about Roman. If we don't pay fairly, go work for someone else. Yeah, whatever. I don't do this crap for the money anyway. I just here for the pussy, man. Yeah? Girls dig this car, do they? Useful to know. It's not the car, my friend. It's the player driving this shit. I pick up a girl from the airport. I'm gonna be hitting that shit up in a hotel room soon as we get there. For real, man. I had my hands on more tourists than airport security. If a woman turns up at Francis International, then this guy is going to know about her concealed weaponry. You get me? Sure. You bang tourists. I get the point. My friend, I got so much pussy around this town, I'm surprised there's any left for the rest of you chumps. Me too. Roman is doing well. You see this new car, my friend? We're going to Mohanet Avenue. Just my luck. You're a charming guy, you know that? Screw you, shitface. You remind me of my wife, man. Take advantage of my generosity and insult me at the same time. You got a wife? How about all that women you pick up in the car? My friend, you are a bitch. I thought you were ever since I first see your ugly ass face. Wouldn't matter that I got a wife. If you've been married for three years, you'd realize getting pussy is a very different thing. Don't you love her? Of course I love her, my friend. She cooks for me and does my laundry. I love that woman, yeah. But I love pussy too. There ain't no tying this warrior down. I'm an animal. I need that pussy. He's doing good. But he still get me to pick up his piss-faced cousin for free. Aren't I lucky, boy? Piss balls! Roman is real lucky to have you working for him. Your customer service is impeccable. You want to know about my customer service? You ask one of my female passengers. They'll tell you I service them good. Great. I'm sure that must be good for you. It is good for you. Real good. I love that shit almost as much as the bitches do. And I tell you something. The women are actually paying for their rides, not freeloading like a certain ugly Eastern European immigrant scumbag I know. If you didn't have your cousin, you wouldn't have anything. How come you too lazy to start a business like Roman did? I might not work either if I was getting all the money in free rides I wanted from my cousin. I look after Roman. I help him out. Sure you do. You help him get into trouble. I know your type, homeboy. Don't think I'm not streetwise, Holmes, because I seen shit you couldn't imagine. For real, my friend. For real. Okay, then. For real. Bring your ugly free riding pace into my car very fast, my friend. I want to go to Pyrite Street. All right, let's go. You better be enjoying yourself back there, because I'm hating every second I have to drive you around for free. Yeah? Well, maybe you should chill out. 
You're going to have a heart attack getting so angry the whole time. You know how much a driver can get paid in this city? Shit. <laughs> a yellow cab is just a license to steal, man. This don't pay too bad. When I'm driving real fares, that is. Not just Roman's stupid cousin. You don't like driving me talk to Roman. He can send one of his other drivers. You'd love that, wouldn't you? Get a hard-working father of six fired because he didn't treat you like God's gift to the earth. You're cold, man. Ice cold. You really want me to get fired? No, of course I don't want you to get fired. You got a job to do. Shit, I didn't realize you had six kids. Well, I probably got about six kids. My wife hasn't had any yet, but the amount of pussy I get, man, there has to be some out there, doesn't there, you know? Sure, whatever you say, lover man. I don't want to trouble you, but uh, I would prefer another radio station. Ugly moron with no taste in radio stations. Hey, angry man, you better be going somewhere close. I need to pick up some real fares so I can make real money. The whole digging in the crates crew, rest in peace to Big L. Oh, Liberty City is live, baby. I was thinking you would say, Sick Bondage Club. You wouldn't mind putting it on a different radio station, would you? I suppose you want me to suck your balls later too, my friend. So, am I taking you to a big drug deal or some shit, my friend? You got a package of snow strapped to your chest? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what? You didn't think I was down with that game? You didn't think I knew what you were about? I done all kinds of crazy shit. I only started driving this cab to make my wife shut up. You can't go around busting caps in people when you got responsibilities. Perhaps you shouldn't go around busting caps in people regardless of your responsibilities. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Next thing you are going to tell me I shouldn't be having extramarital affairs. You got to do that shit to survive, my friend. Of course. And to help your survival, you should just stick to driving this car, man.